I was going to say I've bought another tent, but that would be a lie. I've bought half a tent. I'll show you what I mean in just a minute. So this is what I've got. It is the vestibule for my black diamond highlight. So it's to kind of make it a bit more flexible, make it into more of a family tent for base camping. So with the hang tags on it, it's adding about 580 grams. I reckon by the time I take the excess stuff off, it's half a kilo. This seems to be a hook and loop system that goes round the outside of the tent. Put the pole under tension, attach one, two, three velcro points and uh, then we just hook it to the main tent body. So here you can see the, the hooks that attach onto the corresponding straps on the front of the door and it should be good to go. The door just single tie back as normal with a toggle, so that's quite straightforward. It's got one wired vent, hooded vent, with a midge net interior there to keep the midges out of the vestibule. It really does add a lot of space to the tent, I'm quite impressed. It must be at least a metre deep at its widest point. The vestibule comes with three pegs, but I've pretty much just doubled up the lines onto the existing pegs where I can. But you still need the three just to hold the corner and the front and the other corner. It has a chunky tension band running right across the vestibule to hold the hoop in place. Probably a wee bit over the top, could probably be thinner. This I found quite curious, but actually not a bad idea. The flap, the zipper flap, is on the inside. So there's no flap to catch the wind. Once the wind gets up, no noise, and it doesn't lift away from the zip. Typical ladder lock buckle, just to tension the very front of the vestibule. And the pole terminates in an eyelet which is attached to the main tent. It's quite low to get in. It's quite low profile, but it's, uh, there's enough seating height. Tons of room for gear, plenty of room to cook. Yeah, it's actually, for 500 grams, it really kind of transforms the tent. Yep, two of us could sleep across here, no bother. So there you go, with a normal cooking pot and an Osprey 45 litre rucksack, which will stand up just to give you an idea for height as well. Um, yeah, no problem, a couple of packs out of the way here, cooking here, no bother, shoes etc. I really do think this might work as an all rounder for all situations. Three season, four season, one person and two person. So there you go, it's a £100 add-on to a £300 tent. Um, but it really transforms it. It's very deep. It's over a metre deep, which is really more impressive than I thought. So I think it will be the ideal scenario for one person, two person. Uh, saving weight at around about 1.8 kilos or just over two if I take the vestibule. Split between two of us, that's nothing. So yeah, it looks like it might be the ideal scenario for this year's camping whenever we get out. So if you have any questions, please just leave them below and I'll try and get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks again for watching.